St. Helena is about the Gullah people, African Americans who live in the low country region of South Carolina and Georgia. The region includes both the coastal plain and the Beaufort Sea Islands. The largest group of enslaved Africans brought into Charleston and Savannah came from the rice growing region of West Africa, known as the Rice Coast. The Gullah were successful in preserving their African cultural and linguistic heritage more than any other African-American community in the United States. At the start of the Civil War, the Union Army headed to the region to blockade Confederate shipping. The white planters on the Sea Islands abandoned their plantations, fleeing to the mainland, leaving the Gullah slaves behind. Union forces arrived at the Sea Islands in 1861 to find the Gullah people eager to fight for their freedom. Many did just that, serving with distinction in the Union Army's 1st Carolina Volunteers. Beaufort, South Carolina Sea Islands were the first place in the South where slaves were freed. Today, the Gullah people continue to preserve and share their heritage through cultural festivals in the Low Country. St. Helena is the name of an island in South Carolina's Low Country region. But for me, it's the name of the subject of this painting as well as a symbol of the strength and dignity of the Gullah people.